this is Pranay from SRPL Agro. So today uh, we will check a classic rack product which will be mounting on flat roof. Basically this product is a penetrative type racking system. Okay. So we have a minimal component to be used for this particular product and this racking is a fantabulous racking for new panels and for a wide range of modules which is available in market. So first of all we will start with component introduction. What are the components in it? This there are basically four type of different components which will be used in this product. Okay. This is base profile which will act as a base support. This is leg profile. Okay. This leg profile is used in front and back positions. Okay. This will be in different side okay this is a clamping bracket this clamping bracket it is made up of ADC 12 and this clamping bracket you can get in different tilt angle that is 5 10 and 15 degrees this base profile it is made up of 6063 material okay and this is a extrusion profile okay this is a strut purling okay which will be 4141 strut purling which will uh, will be using in this structure okay and the rest of the things are fasteners like midline and clamp and for joining all this structure so first of all what we will do is we will assemble this base profile with this base leg base profile with this leg okay so now I am installing 10 degree structure. So uh, first of all what I will do is take this base profile, insert it into it and what you need to do is you need to take this 70 mm bolt okay with these two plain washes okay into it and directly clamp this 70 mm bolt at this particular point so, so that your installation will be faster okay like this there is a plain washer at this and this side okay and directly fasten it okay take an allen key and tighten it in this way you need to fast Similarly at this particular position. Similarly we need to do this 70 mm assembly at this particular hole also and fix this leg in this way. We need to make this foot ready completely. After doing this what we need to do is we only need to mount this clamping bracket at this particular position. This clamping bracket comes in as I have already introduced like 5, 10 and 15 degree. So according to your requirement you need to tell us that which uh, tilt angle you required like now I am using a 10 degree tilt angle. So accordingly we will provide the length of this uh, leg supports okay. So what exactly this plate how this exactly this plate will be uh, used I will just tell you this plate which is made up of die casted product this plate will be install in this particular box channel and what you need to do is you need to take this 70 mm bolt a plain washer at this side and another side and directly clamp this bolt in this way so that this plate will be fixed and tight it Okay, once this plate is fixed, you can see the tilt angle which we have given to this plate, it is a 10 degree tilt angle. So this tilt angle, it has been used for tilting your solar panels. Okay, so according to this tilt, your tilt of the panel will be done like 5, 10 and 15 degree. So this leg has been ready. Similarly, this is the front leg. Similarly, you need to do 
for a back leg. So I have already made this back leg and you need to place it at a particular distance according to your panel length. Okay, this structure you can place in landscape and portrait orientation. So basically this is been designed only to reduce the component. Okay, this keeping all the engineering perspective in mind that reduce the structure weight basically okay and how we can install this on your rooftop basically you can create a foundation and directly on that in that foundation you can uh, drill a mechanical anchors or you can drill a chemical anchors into it and fix this on your foundation basically or otherwise there is a second option directly Keep this structure on your RCC slab and do a uh, drill on RCC slab if uh, your client uh, allows you to drill it and put a chemical anchors into it so that to avoid a leaking into your slab. So chemical anchoring is suggested when you directly do it on slab. Okay. So this is how we can do the assembly of this structure. So now what we will do is. I will just keep a demo panel for you so that you can have an idea of this. Basically, what after doing this, what you need to do is, as we know, there is no rafter, no purlins in this to avoid the uh, slight uh, uh, human error. What it we it is created during casting the blocks or while uh, um, installations. So to avoid that tolerance, we are giving this 150 mm uh, length uh, CR purlins on this particular portion so that whatever slightly deviation in the casting of that blocks or might be while uh, placing this anchor fastness into these slabs. So this will be encounter at this particular rail length. Total 150 length is been given in of, uh, to this rail, uh, quite tolerance. To move horizontally okay so this has been used okay at each place so this rails how it gonna install on that uh, clamping plate with the help of self drilling screw this self drilling screw what you need to do is we we give a pre drill hole on this rail only you need to do is this pre drill hole you need to drill it at this particular clamping bracket and fix it Okay, like two type, uh, two side, one at this side and sec second on back side. Okay, so this rail will be fixed on this particular rail. After fixing that rail, what you need to do is you need to use this spring nuts. Okay, so that this spring nuts can easily go into this and a self locking type spring nut will be fixed into this rail. After fixing that spring nut, you just take this M clamp and M clamp with M25 mm bolt, okay, and plain washer and spring washer directly place this at this particular portion and don't fix it tightly, only adjust it. Once if you place this mid clamp and clamp, and there is a chance of movement. So you can adjust it according to your requirement. Once your panels comes at this particular end, you can tighten it firmly. So, so that this panel fixing will be done appropriately as per your requirement. Only this of easy installation will help you to install your solar structure quickly in your site okay at your site so thanks for thanks for watching this video please like and subscribe our channel